White flag raised, and they're off. Making the run across to the straight. And the first to show is Petty Mouchoir the Grey, going on a couple of lengths in front of Classical Dream, being followed by Stable Companions, Charger on the outside of Saldir, and at the back of the quintet, the big outsider, Yaha Fez. Racing on up the straight to their first flight in the Unibet Morgian Hurdle. Grade one, over two miles and eight flights. And out in front at the first, Petit Mouchoir, big jump by Classical Dream on his seasonal bow. This is being followed by Charger, distinguishing green cap alongside a Saldir and a bit of a break to Yaha Fez, the back marker. Making their way uphill away from the stands towards the second flight and it's Petty Mouchoir, Rachel Blackmore leading by three. Classical Dream, Paul Town in second, the favorite followed by Charger. Paul uh, Patrick Mullins on the outside of Saldir and Danny Mullins, and then Yaha Fizz and Martin Mooney. Turning right-handed to go towards the second flight, and it's Petty Mouchoir, two and a half to three in front of Classical Dream, followed by Saldir, who's racing in company with Charger. Yaha Fizz remains last of the five. As they race downwards to the third flight, and it's Petty Mouchoir, tracked by Classical Dream, Last season's top shelf two mile unbeaten novice and bidding to give his trainer Willie Mullins an unprecedented ninth Morgiana in a row. Little to choose then between stable companions Saldir and Charger for that third spot and then Yaha Fez. Over the third flight they go at the bottom of the track and it's Petty Mouchoir a couple of lengths in front of Classical Dream. Saldir's on the inside of Charger. And the back marker remains Yaha Fez. They race down the far side soon, reaching the halfway stage in the 100,000 euro Unibet Morgiana hurdle. And little changes from Flagfall. Petty Mouchoir, followed by Classical Dream, matching strides then in behind Classical Dream, Saldia and Charger, who upset the odds in last year's race when beating Faheen. And the top four have gone away from Yaha Fez over the flight at the halfway stage where Saldir was a little fiddly. And it's Petty Mouchoir taking them past the halfway stage, tracked all the while by Classical Dream and then Saldir and Charger and Yaha Fez. Over the last flight down the far side is the head for the final five and a half furlongs and Petty Mouchoir, Rachel Blackmore. Stalked by Classical Dream, Paul Town, and then Saldir on the rail, Danny Mullins, alongside Charge and Patrick Mullins, gone clear from Yaha Fez and Martin Mooney across they come to the third last flight, Petty Mouchoir, yet to be headed, followed by Classical Dream, Saldir, Charger racing together third and fourth, and then Yaha Fez as they come away from that third last flight. Petty Mouchoir, followed by Classical Dream, Saldir and Charger, and then Yaha Fizz as they jump the second last flight. And a good run now to the last one in the straight in the Unibet Morgiana hurdle. Petty Mouchoir had gone right up on the outside. Classical Dream now within half a length. Two lengths back to Charge and Saldir as they run the home turn. One flight left to jump. Petty Mouchoir on the outside is Classical Dream who's tanking up one off the rail. Then Saldir and Charger racing for the final flight in the Unibet Morgiana hurdle. And Classical Dream is just beginning to edge ahead. Saldir on the outside is throwing down a big challenge. And Saldir, is it Saldir that's going to upset the odds this year? Saldir and Danny Mullins have gone on from Penny Bush, where Classical Dreams lost his streak, and Saldir wins the Unibet. Morgiana from Penny Bush, where Classical Dream third, Charger fourth, Yaha Fizz long last.